Hey guys, Mr. Greg here. I have the funnest thing to show you. I have been growing in my backyard jalapeno peppers. They look like this. Look at that. That's silly. They grow in my backyard now. I put a plant back there and they grow on there. And what's crazy is that the same plant grows green jalapenos and it also grows red jalapenos off the same plant. So I picked some today and we are going to count them. You want to count jalapenos? Jalapenos are a hard word to say. It's even hard to spell. It's crazy jalapeno. It starts with a J, but it's an H sound in Spanish. And these are a Spanish hot pepper. Pretty yummy. Let me show you my jalapenos and let's count. I have 10. We're going to count 10 jalapenos and then we're going to play with the order of them with the green and the red because the colors are kind of cool. Alright, got my jalapenos here. Let's count them all. I've got one, two, three, four, Let's see, five, I've got five jalapenos that are green, and I have five that are red. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Red jalapenos and green jalapenos. Wow. So, Mr. Greg has different colored jalapenos. I have green ones and I have red ones. This would be great for playing our patterns game, What Comes Next? Let's start with a green one and put a red one and then we'll do another green one. What do you think comes next? This is a short, easy pattern. Green, red, green. Hmm. Let's look and see. We can put a green one there and see if that looks right. Green, red, green, green? I don't think so. Green, red, green, green doesn't seem like a pattern because it's not repeating. Let's put a red one in and see if that works. Green, red, green, red. That does work. And then we can put another green one and another red one. Do you see the pattern? Green, red, green, red, green, red. It's kind of like Christmas colors almost. Green, red, green, red, green, red. Now, all right, we're going to start off with a big red one, and then a green one, and then a red one, and then a green one. What do you think comes next? I'm going to turn these so they all fit in good. Red, green, red, green. Red, green, red, green. Red, you're right. You're getting how the patterns work. They just repeat and they just do that over and over. Red, green, red, green, red, green, red, green. See how it just keeps going? Red, green, red, green. Red, green, red, green, red, green, red, green. All right, let's start with two green ones. Let's redo these two green ones. And let's put a red one next to it, and then two green ones. What do you think comes next? Hmm. Green, green, red. Green, green. Green, green, red. Green, green, red. Red comes next. Green, green, red. Green, green, red. Yay! Green, green, red. Green, green, red. See the pattern. What if we put three red ones and a green one? And then three red ones. These are all the red ones. They're a little wrinkly, but they're red peppers. Red, 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 green. Red, red, red. What's the next color? Red, 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 green. Red, red, red. 
Green. You're starting to get how this sequencing works. That's great. All right, let's do green, red, red, green. What do you think would come next? Green, red, red, green, green, red, red, green. I think it's red, red, green, red, red, green, red, red. That is so fun. Taking Mr. Greg's jalapenos out of his garden and counting and sequencing them. 